a gray uh, pickup came with buckets of blood and poured at my gate in Mothaiga. Now, I want to say that normally that is an act of warning. That is an act to say, we are going to spill your blood. Tutamwaga damu yako. Na yako na family yako. For the last 27 days, when I leave my residence, I am followed everywhere I go. They even want me to know they are following me. They come up to where I'm sitting or when we are driving and they photograph me. For the last 27 days, there has been a car parked outside my residence that does nothing else but make sure that I cannot talk on my phone, I cannot watch TV, and I can get no signal in or out of that residence. So when the court ordered the police and the government to stay away from entering my house, they decided to do so through the airwaves. I don't know what William Ruto you hope to achieve by this nonsense. The other day I was dropped at home and the car that left was stopped on Mothaiga Road and you wouldn't believe it. The Subarus that stopped the car came out of the car and threw eggs at the windscreen. This is how childish people have become. We are not scared of you, William Samoy Ruto. Scared of you. If you think this is going to keep our mouths shut, ha, Paul Esad. We are going to speak truth to you. Because June 25th, 2024, you lost your legitimacy. And until you bring back this bill, this financial year is not legitimate in our eyes and even in the world. You saw Vile Ata Wazungu and Akutema Sasa. It's because you are not legitimate. I urge you, I urge you today, before it's too late, seek legitimacy from Kenyans. We want a general election. Try and get back your mandate. Kenya Kwanza Ilikwisha, June 25th. 25th of June Ilikwisha. Get back your legitimacy by having the courage to have and to call a general election. A general election. Anything short of that, you are buying <laughs> what you call the script for your exit. At a way, you are defining bila we unataka kuondoka. The more oppression, the more oppression that will come onto you. Yes. Asante ni sana.